Hi fellow artists, my name is Lauren, I am the artist behind Potato Art Studios and in today's video we'll be unboxing a complete set of 48 pastel pencils from the brand Koinor. So if you're interested in seeing how my order arrived and what the pencils look like, just keep on watching. I purchased my pastel set from Amazon and it was shipped in the standard bubble mailer that most items are packaged in. So I'm going to just cut through the bubble mailer and show you how the set looks like. So the first thing that you'll notice is that there is a cardboard sleeve on the outside and that just has the brand name and the logo of the brand. and the actual pencils are packaged in a metal tin. So Koinor does sell assorted sets of 12, 24, 36, and 48, and I chose to purchase the largest 48 count set. And I'll have a few affiliated Amazon links in the description box below. So the top cover comes completely off, and underneath it, is going to be the first half of the pencils. So there are 24 pencils on the top set and there are two little cardboard tabs. So as I lift up each tab, you'll be able to see the second set of 24 underneath it. On the back side of the tin, there is some additional product information. Uh, one thing to note is that the color names and numbers are not provided on the back side, so you would have to look this information up on the Koinor official website. But it does say that the products are made in the Czech Republic and it shows the colors. If you've purchased pastel pencils before, you'll know that they're quite fragile and prone to breakage. And so with just the padding on the envelope and the aluminum outer packaging of the tins, the package did receive a little bit of damage to one corner, but it was very, very minor. And the pencils themselves were not damaged at all. So in the next few minutes, I'll just be doing a couple of color swatches on 10 different pastel colors, and I'm doing swatches on a fairly dark paper. The specific paper I'm using is the brand Claire Fontaine's Pastel Matte in the color Anthracite. And so I'm just trying a few assorted colors just to show you the vibrancy and the saturation of color over a fairly dark surface to give you an idea of the color range. And if you've tried a couple different pastel brands in the past, I would say that the color pigmentation and firmness is most similar to Stabilo's Carbothello line and Conti's pastel line. So if you are familiar with those two brands, these are fairly comparable to those two in texture and color opacity. I mentioned earlier in the video that the packaging does not contain any information about the color numbers or light fastness ratings, but that information is available through the Koinor website. So I'll have a link in the description to where you can get the PDF with all that information, and I also copied the color chart here. So you can see that all 48 colors have been swatched by the brand, and there is a light fastness rating. The brand Koinor rates their light fastness on a scale of one to four stars, where one is not light fast and four is very light fast according to their testing standards and you can see that the majority of the pencils are rated light fast so they are rated three or four stars there are no pencils that are rated one star there are four pencils rated two stars 16 that are rated three stars and 28 so the majority of pencils are rated four stars according to the brand Another thing I want to point out is that there are 10 colors I received in my set 
that did not match up with the official color chart provided by Koinor. So specifically, these 10 numbers here that I have listed on the screen were the color numbers that were listed on the pencil but do not match up with the chart. So as I was cross-referencing the colors, I found that there were colors that were similar to the colors that I had in my set, but the numbers did not match. With some detective work, I was able to make an estimation and guess which colors belong to which numbers based on the colors that I was missing and the colors that I saw on the color chart, but there were two colors in particular that I could not find in my set, and those were number 52 Sienna and 15 Light Violet. So instead of these two colors, I had an extra medium green that was similar to the chromium oxide green, and I had another orange that was similar to the dark orange color. So I did contact the Koinor customer service line and I provided them all the information I just shared with you. So if they're able to get back to me with an updated color chart or a explanation on why the colors I received did not match their chart, I'll update you in the description box. And if you are interested in learning more about pastel pencils, I do have a fairly comprehensive review guide on my website potatoartstudios.com and I'll have a link in the description box below where I compare the brands Carandash, Conti, Derwent, Stabilo, and Faber-Castell all in one post. As always, thank you very much for watching my video and if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. I greatly appreciate it and I'll see you in my next one.